Uh, let's talk about awareness first. One of the issues, I, I see it as an issue, that the whole non-destructive testing industry as a whole has is, be, is that no one really understands what it's about if you're not working within the industry. If you ask someone uh, if they understand what a cardiologist does, they would say absolutely. They're there for heart health. If you ask someone what someone is, um, do they know what a plumber is? Do they know what an architect does? But if they ask them what someone in non-destructive testing does, they won't have a clue. Well, clearly all of us in the field understand how important it is. You know, we keep planes from falling out of the sky and pipes from rupturing at refineries and atomic reactors functioning well without having major issues. I mean, all the kinds of things that we do, welds uh, staying in place and being done the way they should be. It's critically important that people in the general populace understand what it is we do and why it's important and how it affects their lives. You hear about a bridge when it collapses, but you clearly don't hear about all the ones that don't. So why don't they collapse? because people in this field are doing their job silently, seamlessly, and somewhat transparently. We have an amazing career opportunity in this field. I mean, the wages are far ahead of most other entry-level positions, and the need is growing every day, yet we have very few educational institutions focused on programming and on educational instruction, and very few people aware of what a career in this industry is all about. That comes with public awareness. If we need to have legislation either focused or adjusted because it impacts our uh, field in non-destructive testing, it's a lot easier to do that if people understand, particularly legislators understand, why it's so important and what it is we do. So I think it's really important to engage our membership, all of our membership. A lot of folks take certifications, they become certified in different components of non-destructive testing, and then they go off and do their work, which is, which is good, but they're not engaged in the organization. We are the organization for non-destructive testing individuals. And as such, we glean our strength by the engagement of our members. So the more engaged they are, the stronger we become, the stronger we become, the better our ability is to educate folks on what we do, to impact all of those areas around us, and to provide resources to academic institutions um, and to raise awareness of non-destructive testing as a whole. And to that, we're committed to doing this globally. For a lot of years, we were focused somewhat inwardly, which again is the same as not being known to the general public. If we're focused inwardly in our field, we're not making the connections, we're not becoming engaged, as much as we need to be on a global uh, basis. We don't live in a society where we can be insular anymore. Then the internet changed all that. And every day, almost exponentially, in a way, we become more global in our focus. And as an organization, we need to adopt that same kind of methodology. And that's what we're doing. We're spreading out. We're engaging with our other organizations involved in this around the world. We're going to be becoming more involved in our certification programs around the world. We're going to become more involved in training and teaching. And we will continue to maintain our position both domestically and internationally as the preeminent organization involved in non-destructive testing. We are going to engage more with universities and um, high schools and junior colleges to try to get more programming started and focused on non-destructive testing. We really want to see our membership, particularly those that aren't engaged now, become engaged. And the opportunity exists for every single member to become involved in the process. You don't have to have any specific or special skills. You don't have to have any specific or special experience. You just have to have the desire to become involved in doing something special for the non-destructive testing field. This is a very different organization than it was a year ago. And it is going to be very different a year from now than it is right now in a positive way. We're much more cohesive. The membership is much more involved in running this organization, in setting its priorities and goals, and in helping us develop the roadmap for where we want to be. And where we want to be is where the membership has decided they would like to see the organization. 
So it's very much a member-centric organization now. Uh, the membership is running this organization as far as setting priorities and goals. So I would really encourage all members to get involved. It doesn't take a lot of time. So it's, it's a terrific time to be part of ASNT. Uh, it's a wonderful organization and it's getting better by the day.